I'm Martha Lane Fox and I have worked in internet technologies for far too long. In the next five years, I think we're going to face the biggest challenges around the use of internet technologies. People talk about a splinternet. Right now, we're already looking at the way the internet is becoming balkanized, but in five years' time, I think that's going to be much more profound. China's internet will be in competition to our European internet, which will have its own specific set of regulations and probably be counter to a Russian internet, perhaps even an Iranian internet, a North Korean internet. So you're going to see this idea of different walled gardens much more pronounced than they even are today. I think that our concerns as individuals around privacy and surveillance issues are going to become even more front of mind. I don't know quite how they're going to be resolved. In 50 years, I think actually we will have got over some of these speed bumps. If I look at my children, they're six, their notion of technology is going to be so wildly different to mine and clearly to other people born even in the next decade. It'll be like air, it'll be the connective tissue between all of us and I don't believe that will feel in such a difficult and complex and dark way. I think we'll get used to it, I think there'll be effective regulation around some of the things that we feel more anxious about and I actually think the capacity for human innovation and technological advances will be immense. I think the use of big data will have helped us cure dramatically complex problems such as cancer, such as the climate crisis. Not that they'll all be nailed, not that every single issue that we face will be sorted out, but I think we'll have made massive inroads and I actually believe that this will be a golden age of how we use technology. Firstly, I think that we're already seeing it. If you look at where money is going right now into investments that are going to pay off on a much longer view, you can think about space and the use of technology to get us much further into our known universe. So I think if you look at kind of the big internet moguls of now, Elon Musk, Jeff Bezos, to name a couple, they are already investing billions, and it will be squillions in 500 years' time, into exploring different planets. And I think we'll look back in... 500 year view and imagine the world and the universe as so different to how we see it now. I don't know whether we'll be living on different planets, but I am absolutely certain that our Earth will feel small compared to the exploration that will have happened by then, often powered by the technologies perhaps that we're beginning to tease out today. The second thing is if you look at the pace and acceleration of change, it is just breathtaking and that is something that I think will continue forever. I actually think that human ingenuity, creativity and capacity for change and adaption is one of the most extraordinary known things we've ever explored. Thank you.